Hey, what's up, guys? Morning. Here with the great gardener. About to do a little bit of a, I guess, morning a, sesh. a morning sesh, but a not quite wake and bake sesh. We've already had food. We've already baked a bit. But, it's 2.30. Uh, we've got the ceramic insert cleaned very nicely. We found out that the torch definitely does clean the ceramic better than trying to scrape it with a skillet tool. And just grab the golden dabber there. Afghani. Yes. The Afghanis. You can go closer with that one too. It'll actually focus. Nice. That one's the Barber Bud, 73. Ooh, Such a nice color and flavor on that Barbara. Hey, Omo 120. Beautiful. What's to start with? Hey, Oma. Mm -hmm. You just said Hey, Oma. Oh, Afghani, I meant. But this is. Oh, this one's the Afghani Hey, Oma Dry Sift we made right. yesterday. That's the one. That's a mix. That's the one. To that one. Let's hit it. Let's drop that on the ceramic. Uh... Do, 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 do. Pull that down. I'll lift it up. Give them the view. Oh, that's melty though. Pretty melty. Yeah, nice taste. Mm -hmm. I think I am going to hit... What are you going for? I think I'm going to hit the barb. 45. The barb. Nice difference in the colors. I just want to show them real quick. The barb, you can tell that there's a difference in terpenes right there. One is almost a reddish color, this one here. This one has much more of a blonde color to it. And this is the 45, the reddish, darker one, and the more, I wouldn't say reddish, but almost the orangish tinge to it compared to the, the more blonde. For sure. There you go. Pretty stoked on this little ceramic insert that Dnell sent me. Um, now that we've actually figured out torching it and getting it, um, getting it properly cleaned, it's it's a pretty pretty neat little unit. Just paint the, the, the melt right onto it and it just bubbles quite lovely. Whoa. Oh, nice save though. It's not as tippy as you think, hey? Mm -hmm. I find yeah, just the right I, angle. If you hit it on the side, it'll exactly. scoot sideways. I find sideways when I touch it, I, I'm more inclined to touch it in the middle almost than on the edge. On the edge it tends to do its little... I'm sure the guys will figure it out. This was originally designed to insert into the titanium nail. My titanium nail that I have was a special nail mm -hmm. that they ground down and the walls were a little thicker, so it didn't fit into it. So I figured <coughs> if it sits on the tie nail like that, it could sit on the quartz nail like that. So mm -hmm. they were surprised. They had no intentions of using it with a quartz nail, but uh, I'll tell you, I have every intention of using it with a quartz nail. Anybody else? Off camera. I'll do one more on camera. Which one are you going to hit? I think I'm going to hit this Barbara 120. <clears throat> the light. The light. Have you seen the light? Alright, let's see if we can just paint that on there. You're losing oh, it. I lost it. I better heat it up first. Sometimes it's best to heat the dabber up. Just a tiny little bit on the nail or on the ceramic. You can literally pick up a nice big rock and paint that on there. Bring around the rosy. That was delicious. We're going to continue to do much of this and we'll get back to some hash making uh, probably in the near future.
And more, more importantly, some uh, some interviews with uh, the great gardener about just how he runs the, the garden, a little bit of uh, the people that help him, and just sort of an all-around, I know, I know a lot of you guys have questions and stuff, so we'll get to some of those questions as well. All right, peace.